Next then, I'd like us to look at running some cell detection within this image. And whenever we run the cell detection, we've got a lot of parameters to choose between, and I'm going to explain some of them now in a bit more detail. But to give us the opportunity to optimize the parameters, we should select a region that contains a decent amount of variation in the cell types, but is also quite small so that we can run the cell detection very quickly. If we have a large region, it'll take longer. Okay, so I've selected a region here, and I can go to Analyze Cell Analysis and find the command there. I don't really recommend going to the menus. I recommend instead memorizing a shortcut, Control and L. That will bring up a command list, and then in that I can start to type cell detection, and that will bring up any commands that have that in the name. And so that's a much easier way of finding the commands that you want rather than finding them through this menu. Having done that, I can use the arrow keys to move up and down and select them. I can double click on it if I want, or I can move the arrow keys, and then I can press enter, and that will select the command. And so that avoids having to use the mouse. I can actually run the command just from the keyboard. 